Russian intelligence. Well, anyone in the media who dared question Hunter Biden's business dealings or how much Joe Biden knew about those dealings was deemed a conspiracy theorist. Senators Chuck Grassley and Ron Johnson spent more than a year investigating the Biden family corruption. On the Senate floor today, Chuck Grassley blasted the blatant cover-up of their work. Those same liberal outlets that disparaged our investigation now report that Hunter Biden's financial deals in China raised counterintelligence concerns. So you can understand why I think it's very outrageous that the fourth estate would choose to ignore facts when they are uncovered by Republicans. The Senate has produced a report covering many of Hunter Biden's past business dealings with China, including some that are flagged for, quote, potential financial criminal activity. For more on that, we turn to Hillary Vaughn in Wilmington, Delaware. Hillary. Hi, Lou. We went digging around for what Hunter Biden was up to, who he was doing business with in the days, months and years leading up to the grand jury investigation that we now know kicked off in 2018. Fox News is now learning that that grand jury investigation is not just digging into Hunter Biden's taxes, but also covers money laundering and also suspicious foreign transactions from China. So a Senate report looked into Hunter Biden's overseas business deals and they were led to two conclusions. Hunter Biden had business relationships with Chinese nationals linked to the communist government, and those connections turned up millions of dollars in cash flow that Hunter Biden benefited from. The Senate report also says that financial records that they obtained tied to Hunter Biden show, quote, consistent, significant, and extensive financial connections between Hunter Biden and Chinese nationals connected to the communist regime, and say that these raise criminal financial concerns. So we looked at the money trail and we saw detailed in the report Hunter Biden's business relationship with two Chinese businessmen, Ya Jiangming and Gawen Dao, whose connections to the Chinese Communist government were extensive. In September 2017, Hunter Biden opened a line of credit with Ya's right hand man, Gong Wen Dong, under the business name Hudson West Three. That same account has credit cards given to Hunter Biden, Joe Biden's brother James, and his wife Sarah, and the three of them used those credit cards to go on a $100,000 spending spree on hotels, restaurants, and Apple products. Between August 2017 and September 2018, that same business, Hudson West 3, sent frequent payments to Hunter Biden's law firms, totaling $4.7 million just over that year. And also during that same time frame, Hunter Biden's law firm sent 20 wire transfers, totaling $1.3 million to Joe Biden's brother, James, consulting firm. Several of these transactions tied to Hudson West 3 and Hunter Biden were flagged in this report as suspicious and possible financial criminal activity. And that was noted in this report, Lou, that came out well before we just found out this grand jury investigation went public two days ago. Lou? Hillary Vaughn reporting. Uh, it is a blockbuster day of developments.